The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everyone. Basil Chapman for the 2 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. The Dow is down 237 at 34,235. <clears throat> it tried to rally early on. It actually had a pretty good rally. It was the only one rallying uh, after last night's debacle with uh, um, NVIDIA spiraling to the upside, getting all the, every, all the other indices quite excited. And then it gave back quite a bit, and the others are given back a lot more. So the day is young. We'll see what happens. But as far as the Dow is concerned, uh, that 34,200 to 34,100 area is going to be really sacrosanct in terms of holding over the next day or so. We're looking at the S&P <clears throat> gave back huge gains as well. It was up at the 4858 level. It's now at 4401, 4402. Can you believe over 53 points it gave back? Well, the day's young. Anything can happen, but this is not good action. Looking at the QQQ, the index 100, trading down three, uh, down 475 at 364. Really big reversal here. And that goes with the weekly chart that says, you know, you've been holding so well. You've got to keep that up because you don't want to go from a buy mode to a sell signal on the weekly chart. And that could be coming up. We'll watch it closely. IWM acting very poorly. It's down almost two at 183. Gold, <clears throat> this is going to be very interesting because gold is holding steady, down three at 1945 at the exact same time as we are looking at the dollar, really 103.87, up 48 cents. This is um, pretty good action for the for gold for the dollar, and it's and it's not impacting gold. The silver is acting way better than gold, and the TLT. Hmm, I didn't do that because I had a lot of stock questions when I just did the show a moment ago for Larry, who's uh, <clears throat> uh, whose voice is recovering. Ninety five oh two down fifty three cents in the TLT. It's trying to get off the ground from that ninety two double bottom. We're going to have to watch that closely. <clears throat> I'll do more of that in my show tomorrow, my Tiger Technician's Hour at 10 o'clock. <clears throat> Check out my opening call as well, my daily newsletter. And we're looking at crude oil. Has that rallied? Uh, no, it's now down line ticks. It's trying. It's struggling. It's under the nine period uh, moving average. We're going to have to watch that. It must hold 76 going into Monday or Tuesday of next week. Have a great rest of the day. Stay tuned for Tom O'Brien coming up at uh, 3 o'clock to 4. And... Uh, have a good day. The reality 